tell us your name. What are you doing here? My name's Michael, Michael De Costa. And um, yeah, this is the first time out here displaying my work. Yeah, for the first time ever. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> and um, it looks like you've got some really interesting art here. So it reminds me much. of um, a bit of Tomb Raider, this one down here, and a bit of animation in your art. I don't yeah. know what that is. Um, explain that. <laughs> um, right, this piece. Uh, yeah, 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 there's a, a bit of mystery behind it. It's called I'm Not What You Think I Am. Okay. She's, um, yeah, she's got a hidden agenda. Okay. And it just kind of portrays that looks can be deceiving. I mean, she's got yeah. like the green evil eye there. Yeah, sort of she... Envious and jealousy. Yeah, I kind of perceive her to be a viper. Resemblance of a snake. Yeah, the garment's going into her head and... Yeah, a bit of a dangerous woman. Beautiful okay. but dangerous. So we've also <laughs> got this one over here, which screams attitude and fire and all sorts. I mean, yeah. talk us through that and why did you decide to paint that? And where was that, actually? Right, this was, um, I did a photo shoot in, in the West End. It's a clothing line that I'm actually developing. Um, this is one of the mo models in my photo shoot. And... Uh, yeah, she's wearing one of my garments <laughs> and I thought, I love the picture, she had red hair and I kind of knocked out the rest of the colour and um, yeah, I called it Beauty in the Eye of the Beholder and I just thought it was a striking picture. It definitely is a striking yeah. feature, I mean, the, you've got the fierce eyes going on there, the yeah. pouse lips and then obviously you've highlighted the red hair which shows she's crazy yeah. a bit, yeah. <laughs> a bit yeah. like of a hot Yeah, head. she was a bit crazy, yeah. <laughs> Which is great. So you mentioned you've got a clothing line. So apart from the art, you obviously have the clothing That's line going I'm on. I'm developing inside. it. Yeah, um, it's something that I, I buried for a long time. Um, I lost lost my mother, and I kind of put everything on the back burner. Okay. Um, yeah, and this is me trying to rekindle that the passion for art Just and to keep creativity. Going with it, yeah. Spiritually as well. Yeah, 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 definitely. Yeah, I definitely. feel that. I can see that coming out through your yeah, art, and it's, it's really to, yeah, great. Yeah. Yeah. So, Thank what you. made you want to go into art in the first place? Basically, I was born able. I, I could paint from a young age. I wasn't taught it. I haven't had any schooling. Um, yeah, I, I painted years ago as a child, and then about a year and a half ago. I got back into it, and um, this is me getting back into it. <laughs> <laughs> so, I mean, we're here in Brixton today. Are you a local in Brixton? No, I've actually come all the way down from Dagenham. From where? Dagenham. Wow. Yeah. Okay. A bit, a bit of a journey. And what's the inspirations over there like? I mean, is it quite an arty place like Brixton is? Not or? at all. Not, Not at, at all. all. No, no. <laughs> No, the only inspiration is found in my studio in my home. <laughs> okay, I mean, how often do you come down to Brixton? Not as much as I, I used to. I used to actually work work up here. I used to work with young people. I used to, I used to get do? a lot of inspiration up here. Um, but I, I think moving away, that kind of has a lot to do with killing your creativity, depending on your surroundings. You are what you eat, so, yeah. I mean, with your clothing line, obviously you're on some sort of some sort of social media, I'm guessing. So, no, am I wrong? I, I, <laughs> I am um, not with the clothing, just um, to cross the art design. Uh, yeah, that's what um, I was going to say. Yeah. So with the arts and, and stuff, how do you promote yourself? So right, branding. Um, like... I've only just started on the road of social media, the scary road of social. Not it's so scary. Not you... scary. Well, it is when you don't know what you're doing. But... <laughs> okay, yeah, fair enough. <laughs> um, yeah, a bit of unknown territory for me, but um, yeah, I'm just trying to get out there. And a lot of people have said you need to sell yourself, your work out there, get seen. That's absolutely right. Yeah, and I've been pretty much in my own bubble, and this is me trying to step out. Well, that's yeah. great. Um, so where can we find you? Exactly. You can find me online um, at decostaartdesign.com. Um, I'm on Facebook, Twitter, um, Instagram. Yeah. Um, well, thank you very much thank for talking you. to me. Um, it's been a pleasure to talking with you. Thank you very much. <laughs> uh, I'm Michelle Cabina and this is Idyllic Art TV.